Jolly vibes only. Yes. Go. Step back. Drive. Step four. Ooh. Lower. <coughs> step. God. Oh my Jesus. So this is like what it looks like to film, <laughs> film a reel. Good morning, everyone. Vlogmas day seven. A whole week has already gone by, but we're having fun. I'm glad you guys are enjoying Vlogmas. I really appreciate all the support, like seeing comments that like Vlogmas brings you a lot of joy and you've been watching for years and it just means so much and that's why I do it. I'm just so glad that you're enjoying the best part of everyone's day, especially you. Bruno's advent calendar time, babes. I need to find it before I get down there because then once I'm down there, I feel pressure because he's like, come on, mom, where's my treat? And also there's still snow on the ground. Like I'm actually really shocked. Like a lot of it stuck. Um, it must be cold enough. And it just, it's nice because it looks, I don't know, it looks like Christmas because there's not always snow, hardly ever anymore before Christmas. I feel like in the old days, <laughs> there was always not always, but a lot more often snow on the ground at Christmas. And now it's like, feels like hardly ever here. So, okay, here it is. Ready? Let's see, number six, right there. Okay. There you go. Enjoy, pee pee. All right, you guys. So I am, I'm gonna have some breakfast and just like ease into the morning, um, hang out with Anderson for a bit. And then I'm gonna head downstairs and do some sort of a workout. Um, I'm not sure what yet. I, Yarman has um, a bike down there and you can do like bike workouts on Apple Fitness. I'm like just so nervous. <laughs> like I kind of want to try it, but when you haven't done a cycling workout in a while, I'm telling you, it hurts my butt personally, like my butt muscles. Like it makes them feel so bruised. <laughs> like it's a tolerance you really have to build up. And I'm like, do I feel like starting that journey today? Is it smart to start that journey during Vlogmas? <laughs> Probably not. Yeah, we'll see. But I need to, I need to eat and have some caffeine. <laughs> also, it's been like almost 24 hours with this thing and it's been phenomenal. <laughs> Honestly, we're really happy that we bought it. Um, it's just made everything so much easier, you know. We've probably done like three or four cycles over the last 24 hours, so good stuff. It's very good stuff. It's very good stuff, BB Lou. What was in your mouth? <laughs> Whipped up the best breakfast, my breakfast sandwich with pepper jack cheese, egg and turkey bacon on the everything English muffins. So yummy. I need to show you guys what I got for Anderson for tummy time. This like came up as a recommendation on Amazon, so I got it. And it was so funny. Yesterday in the vlog, I said something about like, if your baby likes tummy time, you're lucky. And then he had a really good tummy time session. And I'm like, oh, oh, thank you. So since he really likes to like look at things and is very, um, I don't know, he's just very inquisitive now and like loves to look at things with like color. So um, I got this crab <laughs> and look what it does. I have the sound off right now because he's sleeping over there. <laughs> god. Oh my Jesus. Oh no, that was stressful. Oh my God. Like it's kind of terrifying, <laughs> but putting it like on the floor during tummy time, it has music that you can shut on or off and it goes back and forth like all around so they have something like fun to look at. Um, <laughs> oh, that scared me. Okay, anyway, today's baby purchase from Amazon. I will put a link. Um, I was gonna order it for him for Christmas. I ordered him. It's actually quite funny because I ordered him a couple of Christmas gifts. The second they came, I opened them to use them with him. So, yeah. You got my workout buddy. <laughs> And then I got my sneakers down here. Thank you guys for telling me about the Hoka's being um, too thick for like a strength workout because they definitely were. So now I just wear my old uh, New Balance down here. 
Oh, goodness. Who's excited to work out? Who's excited? Who's excited? <laughs> All right, let's see. New workouts. Let's do something new. I'm not, I'm not doing <laughs> the bike today. We did this one already. Check. Let's see what else. They even have rowing workouts, and we have a rowing machine, so maybe I'll do that eventually. I'm just, I'm still still getting into the groove but let's start with this 20 minute strength with kyle team what is happening coach kyle here with fellow trainers brian Yo. and john l for 20 minutes of total body strength at the fitness plus studio in la go step back drive step forward Woo. lower <coughs> step. there we go okay now you want to make this a little bit more challenging for you you can get a little bit deeper get that's deeper. hard <laughs> Lower down, run, lower down, let's go, Press out, lower, control. Alright, 20 minute total body, 10 minute upper body, that was, you know what I noticed? If you do like, um, not like a 30 minute, but like 20 or 10s, they do it a little bit more intense because like you have less time, so whew, that was good. I'm here with the whole gang. Bruno's freaking out because he gets excited every time we come to the Target pickup. I'm doing a Target pickup because I'm gonna make cookies for people today. Because I was just realizing like this month is gonna go by really fast. We have a lot of other things planned for this month. Um, a day trip, a little mini vacation, well vacation, a little mini getaway for a couple days with the baby. Um, we have like things planned and it's already the seventh. Like I just feel like it's gonna go by really fast and I bought those really cute cookie containers um, and I love to make people cookies every year, drop them off at like my neighbor's house. So um, I saw this really um, fun recipe. It was like kitchen sink cookies, but they were like Christmas version. Like they've got like pretzels, little Christmas colored M&Ms, potato chips. Like they look really, really fun and um, they look very festive. Last year, I made a few more like classic cookies, but I feel like honestly everyone makes classic cookies and I wanted to make something different. So um, I think people will enjoy these as well and doing it on the earlier side of the month. I feel like by the end of the month, everyone is like so cookied out. So um, I think this will be uh, this will be fun. All right, you guys, I am back. So here's what we got. The good thing is they had this little small package of the red and green M&Ms for the cookies because I think the recipe just called for like a third of a cup. So this should be perfect. Then I needed white baking chips. This is probably too many, but um, I'll have leftover. I can just keep these in the pantry. They are good for two years or year and a half. I got more canned chicken for lazy girl buffalo chicken dip, just to have for lunch again. And then these are our favorite toothbrushes right now, the Pulsar Oral-B. Good, they got the soft. And then this was five bucks and it comes with all these different kinds of Christmas sprinkles. So I'm gonna bring this also to my grandma's house when we do cookie day. We need to get that in the calendar. I don't know why I just like does anyone else feel like this December is flying like it's literally the first week's over like I just I don't know it always goes by fast and then I did not forget the butter today if you watched yesterday's vlog <laughs> oh and then we needed pickled jalapenos because I put that on a lot and then everything else we have I have some plain potato chips from our delivery driver snack station um, I have pretzels already, and then I think I have like the usual flour, vanilla, sugar, all that jazz. I checked, so I do. Not I think, I do. So I am gonna go shower, and then we're gonna do a little bit of baking. Oh, and I also, I wanted to show you guys because this has been just so convenient. I wanted to do a little what's in my diaper bag moment because I feel like I cracked the code, bless you. He's doing um, time with on his little play mat. Um, so I feel like I have a really like good system set up with like everything in uh, my purse here. And what's really, really helped me recently was that I took this little bag that was from my hospital bag um, and I put his baby stuff in here to make it so much easier to throw this in or if Yar is going out with the baby I can just give him this or um, if I'm if I'm going out without the baby I can take this out of my purse to save room 
Rather than just having all the stuff in here floating in the bottom of my bag, it makes it easier to find things. Um, it's just, it's been super duper convenient. So this little thing here, it fits exactly what I need perfectly. We have diaper wipes, bunch of diapers. Um, these come very much in handy. These um, pacifier wipes, natural cleaning with baking soda. Um, an extra onesie here. And then in the bottom, this little mini honest um, sensitive sprayable diaper rash cream. This is also game changer, not even just for when you're on the go, but just in general. Um, I do really love the Bordeaux butt cream. It's so good. But uh, I like this too because it's in a spray bottle. So if you are out and you don't wanna like make a mess, you don't have a little spatula or something, you can just spray this. And I feel like it works really well. Um, so I just, I don't know, a sprayable diaper rash cream is just like absolutely life-changing. So it's this perfect just little bag. And then I still do carry this um, changing mat that came with the Kate Spade bag but they have portable changing mats that like roll up and get really small. I do have one, so I'm gonna like swap those out for space as well. And then lastly, just his little pacifier case. It has two slots, so if you drop one, you can have it dirty, but I have the pacifier wipes too. So it holds two pacifiers, so this is great. So that's how I like organize and keep it kind of separate from my purse. And like, it's just so easy to take these things out and then I can just have my purse on its own if I don't need to take this with me or if, like I said, if Yara's is gonna take them. So um, that's been my, my little hack. If you kind of also like use your diaper bag as both a purse and a diaper bag. So, all right, I showered. I have on a Medea Christmas in the background. One thing I will say is I still love having the frame TV up there. Like I know it's, seems silly to a lot of people but i love that we can change out the artwork i love that when we're doing something in the kitchen we can watch the tv here and just have it on in the background or we can see it jolly vibes only yes also check out the hair clip it's like so cute it's a gold bow i love it and it actually is holding up my thick hair um i got it on amazon i will put a link but I think we're ready to start baking. All right, I took a few minutes to get organized to make it extra easy. I'm gonna try to make an aesthetic <laughs> cooking or baking reel um, because I never do and it's kind of fun. So I have everything nicely set up. We've got our sprinkles and I'm doubling the recipe. I will link the recipe that I'm following, doubling it. And I had just the right amount of things. It was perfect. Four egg yolks at room temp. Uh, sugar, brown sugar, baking soda, baking powder, salt, vanilla uh, extract, flour, and then our fun little toppings. So, huh, it feels so good to have everything just like measured and ready to go. I highly recommend, I know it's like more dishes and it's kind of annoying, but if you're gonna load the dishwasher anyway, <laughs> you may as well. It just, it's so much easier now to just be boo bop. Oh, and I have three sticks of butter softening right here now oh i need to go to the pantry remember these we got these at um home goods these adorable little uh window treat boxes so we've got six boxes this should make about 40 cookies which would be a good amount for each person one eternity later all right i'm happy to report that baking went super well um and i the cookies came out really good and i got my cute little reel so i'm gonna cue that here Watch us burn 
Packaged up the cookies all cute. I have to put the ribbon on these. Um, and then I have another box over there. So yeah, that was perfect. I'm glad I doubled the recipe because it definitely would not have been enough had I not. But now it looks crazy in here. So this is like what it looks like to film, <laughs> film a reel. Exhibit A, exhibit B, C, D, E, F, G. <laughs> So yeah, let's do a power clean while Anderson's still asleep. you guys I am about to snuggle up on the couch and edit first and foremost but there's also a new season of 90 day fiance but it is the couples is it called couples retreat or last last resort <gasps> last resort oh my god I'm so glad they did a second season of this show um because the first season was so good and like the couples on the season like I have watched, I think, I think I have watched every 90 Day Fiance spinoff an episode. I think I'm fully caught up, like, so I know everyone on this, which is so exciting. Oh, I'm so excited. I really wanted to watch Home Alone tonight, but like now that I saw this was on my recorded, I'm like, I think I might have to watch this. I might have to watch this. 90 Day Fiance Stan. Let me know if you also are just in deep anyway you guys i have to get to editing and then i'm gonna try to chill out just for a little bit i also just after i did that power clean i also swept and did like a swiffer mop um and your girl is simply pooped i should have merch that says simply pooped on it because simply pooped anyway you guys i love you so much thanks for hanging out with me today and you know i'll see you again tomorrow say goodbye pp lou say bye pp hmm.